Hey, what's up guys? Coach Bobby here. I'm going to walk you guys through one of my favorite workouts, especially on a Monday or beginning of the week. It's called WTF or work to failure. Not the other WTF, although it relates, it's relatable to that. Uh, WTF is for work to failure. The idea is you're trying to maximize the muscle tissue breakdown in the workout. Maximize the overload of two body parts. In this case, we're doing biceps and chest. What I do is I'll go to failure from the very, very beginning. So every single set, every single station, every single seat of the workout is done to failure, right? So work to failure, right? So I normally do opposing body parts or two body parts, all right? So a back and a chest, or in this case, uh, a chest and biceps, and then you do uh, back and, and, and chest again, or back and uh, triceps, all right? So today, I'm gonna do biceps and chest, okay? So I'm gonna go op opposing body parts, I'm gonna alternate between a bicep exercise and a chest exercise. You can do as many as you want. I'm doing one, two, three, four, five pairings, right? Only because I wanna go heavy on my dumbbell presses, all right? So what you wanna do is start light, start light or easier on your movement, and then work your way up in either heaviness, weight, or in complexity or difficulty, all right? So start light, and or easier and work your way up to heavier and more difficult. What that does is allows you a break, but also allows you to get warm in the beginning without doing too much of a warm up. All right. I still want you to warm up, right? Do either one of my warm ups or your own warm up. Uh, but the first few sets, because they're light, give you more time to get the muscles warmed up, get the joints lubricated, get you ready for the heavier weights. All right. So every one of them, I'm going to count the number of reps on the station or on the seat and then do an aggregate number, right? So for example, if I do 30 supine curls, I'm gonna do 30 for the on the station reps and then 30 total. If I turn around and do 20 dumbbell presses, that's 30, 20, but now I'm at 50 total. So I'm gonna count the aggregate number to a certain number. Normally I do 500, I'm gonna to try to do 750 total reps in the workout. It's untimed, right? So you're not in a rush and there's no timer to make you stop early. So every single seat is done to failure, right? And you're trying to get to a total number. In this case, I'm gonna to try to get to 750, all right, in total. So follow along, I'm gonna time, I'm gonna uh, film the whole workout so you can watch how I do it, all right guys? All right, guys, so let's start off with some uh, supine curls, all right? Supine curls. I'm gonna go 20 pounds, 20 pounds, nice and elbows nice and tucked, all right? I'm gonna count and go as far as I can go without stopping to failure. Elbows tucked in. That's 20. That's 30. All right, guys, so that's 45 reps, right, with the supine curls, 45 reps. Right, so we got 45 reps on the seat, 45 total. Now we're going to do dumbbell presses 
Put 50 pound dumbbells. All right, guys, now we're gonna do 50 pound dumbbell presses. Again, we're still going low now. We're, we're starting off so we can go light to start with and warm up and lubricate the joints, all right? Twenty. Six. All right, guys, so that was 38 reps, right? With the dumbbell presses at 50 pounds. So 38 reps. 38 reps in the seat or that chair, right, for a total of, what is that, 45, 75, 83 reps total, right? So 45, right, plus 38 is 83, right? 83 reps. Now I move on to hammer curls at 30. Hammer curls at 30 pounds. All right, guys, now we're doing hammer curls, all right? 30 pounds, hammer curls. Here we go. That's 10, going to failure, you guys, as many as you can. 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 2, 3, 28, 30, Thirty-five guys, thirty-five. So on the curls, I allow myself one time to stop. Right, one time to stop, not put the waist down, but one time to stop, and then regroup, and then when, after that second stop, put them down and move on. Right. Otherwise, you could stay there forever and just do a few and wait and do a few and wait. No, you get one stop, and the very next stop you have to move on. All right. So that was thirty-five reps. All right, guys, so I did 35 reps, right? 35 reps with 30 pound hammer curls. So 35 reps in the station, right? For a total of 118, 118 total. Again, we're going to 750, guys. So next up, dumbbell press, 60 pounds. All right, guys, dumbbell presses now with 60 pound dumbbells. Ah. Uh. 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 Ah.
Alright guys, so that was 25 reps, 25 reps guys with 60 pound dumbbells, okay, 25 reps. So we got 25, right, in the station, and then we got, what is that, 20, uh, 45, minus, minus 243, 143, 143 total, right, 25 reps in the station, 143 total. Up next is 35 pound dumbbell curls. All right, guys, now we have 35 pounds, double dumbbell curls, all right? Double dumbbell curls, here we go. Here we go, 35 pounds. Again, one stop allowed. One stop allowed on the curls. Twenty five, guys, twenty five. All right, guys, so 25, right? 25 reps with 35 pound dumbbells. That means 25, 25 in the chair, in the station, right? For a total of 168, all right? 168, again, going to 750, guys. Long way to go, but it's getting good, it's getting good. Next up, dumbbell press with 70s. All right, guys, so that's uh, 17 reps, right? 17 reps in the station, 17 reps in the station, right? 185 total. 17 in the station, 185 total. All right, next up, we're doing double, again, double dumbbell curls with 40s. Now it's getting heavy, guys, now it's getting heavy. All right, guys, 40 pounds, 40 pound dumbbell curls. Here we go. Ah. 
13. Whew. Ah. 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 16. All right, guys, 16 reps, 16 reps, 16 reps in the station, right? Total of 201 aggregate, 16 in the station, total of 201. All right now we're going 80 pound dumbbells, guys. It's getting heavy, 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 heavy. All right, guys, 11. 11 reps at 80. 11 reps with the 80s. That's 212. 212. 212, guys. Now we gotta go uh, heavy single. Heavy single curls. Heavy singles. All right, guys, heavy single arm curls, okay? Now, I wanna, I wanna incentivize you guys to go heavy, so we're gonna count each arm separately all right so one two three four but you got to go heavy on this one gotta go heavy i'm going 50 so we go four six eight that's 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, 22. All right, guys, 22 reps. Again, each one is separate. So one, two, 22 total, or 22 in the seat. And that's set for a total of two, what is that, 244? 234, 234. 22 in the set, 234 total. All right, now at the very top of the uh, workout, 90 pound dumbbell presses. 90 pound dumbbell presses. Getting heavy, y'all. Getting heavy. Ah, here we go. Nineties. Get a little mad at it. Get a little mad. Get a little mad at it. Huh.
All right, guys, that was six reps, guys. Normally I can get a, a few more. My wrist gave out a little bit. I have a broken wrist. So, but it is what it is, right? So, no excuses. So, six reps in the station for a total of 240. 240 total, all right? So, we're back to the top, guys. Round two. Round two, if you will. Back to the top. Supine curls at 20. All right, guys, let's go supines. Supine curls. Here we go, guys. Let's go. Elbows tucked in tight. All right, guys, 30 reps, right? 30 reps, 30 reps in the station. Okay, we're at 240, now we're at 270, right? 270. I might not get 750, guys, but I'm still shooting for it. 30 in the station, 270 total. Now we're at 50 pound dumbbell presses. 50 pound dumbbell presses. All right, guys, 23 reps, right? 23 reps at the 50s for a total of 293. 293. Hammer curls next. Hammer curls, 30 pound dumbbells next. Yeah. All right, guys, hammer curls. Here we go. Hammer curls, 30 pound dumbbells. Twenty-five, twenty-five. All right, guys. Twenty-five reps. Twenty-five reps at thirty hammer curls. Twenty-five reps for three eighteen total. Twenty-five reps for a total of three eighteen. Now, guys, now we're on to sixty-pound dumbbell presses. As you can see, I'm doing fewer reps at every rung in the ladder. Right? That's how it should be. I'm getting tired. Right? I'm getting tired. So each one should be. Fewer in the first round.
16. All right, guys, 16 reps, right? 16 reps, total of three, 34. Three, 34. 16 reps, 334. 334. All right, guys, dumbbell curls, dumbbell curls. 35 pounds, 35 pounds. 35 pounds, here we go. guys 21 21 reps right 21 reps 21 reps for three five five right three five five three five five now we got dumbbell presses with 70s it's getting heavy <sighs> All right, guys, just 12, just 12. See, us it's dropping off at a 17 last time. Just 12, this round, 12 reps in the station, 12 reps in that set for a total of three, six, seven. Three, six, seven, guys. Now we got 40 pound dumbbell curls, double dumbbell curls. All right, let's go, guys, 40 pound dumbbell curls. 40 pound, 40 pound doubles, 40 pound doubles. guys all right 13 reps right 13 reps right down from 16 13 reps for a total of 380 380 I'm not gonna get to 750 guys but 500 is still doable I normally do 500 so 13 reps in the station 380 total all right now we're going to 80 pound dumbbell presses 80 pound dumbbell presses
All right, guys, I banged out seven. I might have had one more, but my wrist is kind of giving out on me. I got a bad wrist. So seven. Seven is what it is, right? Seven for a total of 387. All right, 387. Now we're going to go heavy curl singles and 90-pound dumbbell presses for the last two. All right, let's go, guys. Heavy single dumbbell curls. Heavy single dumbbell curls. Here we go. Count each hand separately. That's two. That's four. That's six. That's eight. That's ten. That's twelve. Fourteen. 16, 18, 20. All right, guys, 20, 20 reps. Again, counting each arm separately, right? So one, two, we have 407, guys. 407. We're going to 500, guys. All right? My, my normal number is 500. I try to do more today. I don't know why. But yeah, so 500. So 407. We got heavy 90 pound presses and then back to the top. All right? Here we go. Just four, guys, just four. Oh well, here's what it is. Four reps, 411 total. 411 total, back to the top now, guys. We're supine curls for 20. We're 20s. Here we go, guys, 20 pounds, 20 pounds supines. All right, guys, I banged out 29, right? 29 in the station. 29 in the station, right? For a total of 440. 440. 440. 60 more to go, guys. Now we have dumbbell presses with 50s. Ah, 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 ah,
right, guys. We got 20 reps on that one, right? 20 reps in the station for a total of 460. All right, 40 more. 20 reps in the station, total of 460. 40 more to go. Hammer curls with 30s next. Hammer curls with 30s. All right, guys, hammer curls with 30s. Let's go, hammer curls with 30s. Twenty-three guys, twenty-three. All right, guys, twenty-three in the station, right? Twenty-three in the station, four eighty-three total. Almost done, guys. Seventeen more, four eighty-three total, right? Dumbbell press with sixties. All right, guys, couldn't quite, couldn't quite get 17, right? So 15 reps, we have four, 98. I need two more, I'm done. Two more, we're done. All right, guys, two more, but I'll bang out a few extra, because I miscounted. All right, guys, we only had two left, right? We had two left. Okay, so I banged out. I banged out a few extra, all right, in case I miscounted somewhere. So that's it. That's simple, guys. WTF workout. Work to fail your workout. The idea is you're trying to maximize the muscle tissue breakdown, right? Over, overload the muscle groups. Two muscle groups, maybe three tops. Alternate to give your body rest between pull and push and go to a big number, right, aggregately. So I was gonna go to 750, I normally go to 500. So 750 was a lot. So normally, if I have time, I'll finish the round at least, even though I go over, uh, occasionally I'll stop. But you're trying to get to a certain number, all right? Pick 500 to start with, all right? So that was biceps and chest, WTF workout. Work to failure, workout. When I'm losing and gaining games, I'm never losing, I'm gaining games. I'm getting better than yesterday. Told myself I never quit again. Made a promise that I never break. Gotta get it for my people's sake. I'm getting better than yesterday. Told myself I never quit again. Made a promise that I never break.